Prior to the entry of the Jewish people into the land of Israel, the people elect to send spies to spy out the land. We can learn two important lessons from what unfolds. One, Rabbi Nachman teaches that it was the idea of sending spies in the first place that was the sin. You see, says Rabbi Nachman, when you go to war, it's normal to go into the control room, into the war room and plan a strategy to act in line with nature in order to win. However, the land of Israel is not like every other land. It's beyond any other land. It's beyond nature. It's a miraculous place. And therefore, to make stratagems that are in line with nature was a defiance in and of itself and betrayed the very idea of what Israel is all about. That's one. Number two, the Jewish people said that there were giants living in the land, and that they were greater than they. However, God himself said he would bring them into the land, so their accusation wasn't really against themselves, it was against God. And we could say that maybe because of the sin of the golden calf, they felt that they fell, and as a result of the fall, maybe they didn't merit the same kind of providence and love from God. And this in and of itself is a sin as well. Even if we do good, even if we do bad, God's love for us is unconditional.